Today is Friday, March 1st, and I am an adult. So today I've been working on my resume, learning how to write cover letters, and researching internships because summertime approaches, and with it, the need to make monies. Now, my brother lives in Washington, D.C. right now, and that's like a pretty good place to, you know, get an internship at. A lot of them are political type things, and I mean, uh, politics, ew, no. I mean, they're very important, just I, they're not within my skill set. I'm looking at maybe like something at NPR or something at the Folger Shakespeare Library. I got library experience. I like Shakespeare. You know, these things work out, but to get to there, I have to go through all these applications and, you know, how do you adult? It would be a whole lot easier if I could just work here at Smith over the summer. I mean, my boss at the library told me I have a job here. So I could just go past all of the application process and just go straight to the job, but my mom wants me to look for something different. So it's been rough and all adultish lately. You know, I'm not one of those people who will look back on childhood and say that I wish I appreciated it more and I wish that I was still a kid because it was simpler back then. Because, I mean, yeah, it was simpler. I had a really privileged childhood. I mean, you know, look at me. A middle-class white girl. I, I had a pretty good childhood. It, at the time, I thought I wasn't very privileged. I didn't really get the meaning of the term, but, like, I would watch my cousins and some of my friends go off to really expensive summer camps every summer, and they all had pools in their backyard, and that was just everything to me at the time. But really, I was doing fine. It was just, I didn't like the disadvantages of being a child, and I think there are plenty, at least the way I saw it. I was just very aware of the fact that there was a whole lot of world out there that was cut off from me because I was, you know, too young to understand or too young to be allowed or, you know, what have you. Also, I always kind of felt that I was internally old enough for everything. Ever since I was like 11 years old, I had a very high opinion of myself in terms of my maturity. And I think adults kind of in, like reinforced that in me because I was surrounded by idiots. Not really, but pretty much. Anyway, I just always wanted to be older, and I was waiting for college for years, and I could not wait. And maybe it's not exactly as I expected it to be, but every now and then I'll catch myself going to class on a particularly sunny day, and I'll be wearing a really nice outfit, and I'll just think, yeah, like, I did want this. This is where I wanted to be, and this is where I want to go, and... Or at least, you know, I like my life. And it's hard sometimes, but, you know, I could be headed in a really good direction. And I just, like, when it comes to having to do these adult responsibility things, just kind of got to suck it up sometimes. Because you know, there's a lot of responsibilities that are legitimately concerning, but I still got it pretty good. So... I hope that we can make peace with our troubles and, you know, get happy. I'll see you on Tuesday.